clothes pollution, synthetic materials used to make things like yoga pants and fleece jackets are harming the environment. Jenny Goldberg explains how the fibers are getting into our water. I have two little kids at home, so I'm constantly in leggings and pants like mine. But we're learning that those leggings and pants, shirts, and just about any other piece of clothing that's not natural could be harming our environment. A lot of the clothes that we wear are made of synthetic fibers, um, which are plastic. Two of the biggest ones are polyester and acrylic. Harry Soma with Citizens Campaign for the Environment says it's a growing problem. A new study found that our wardrobe and washing machines are to blame. Comfy clothes with microfibers, which are shreds of plastic, are released when we wash them. They travel into our sewage treatment facilities, ultimately polluting our shorelines and waterways. What you can do is wash those clothes less that are made of the synthetic fibers. Washing machines can be fitted with filters. Environmentalists say these fibers are being consumed by fish and could make their way into our diet. The problem is they're so small and hard to detect. But not everyone we spoke with is buying it. I think it really doesn't make much sense. With everything else that is really affecting the environment, I don't think workout pants is where we're going to start. If it is polluting the water, you say? Oh boy, then I'd look for changes. That's for sure. Environmentalists say older jackets with weak fibers shed twice as much as new ones. While there is the risk of fiber contamination, it's a greener way of keeping plastic bottles out of landfills. On Long Island, Jody Goldberg, Fox 5 News.